call this meeting of superheroes to order. As some of you have heard, there's a rumor going around that a new superhero is coming to town. They say that he's going to save the world, and he receives his powers from the big G-O-D. I've heard the same thing. What does this mean? We have saved the Earth. We have been here for years. What does this guy think he's doing? Even though this man or woman is, does he know he's taking our job? I've heard that this G-O-D guy means real business. Apparently, he has some sort of connection with all of us. He says he loves the world so much that he is going to give us his son. This new superhero is here to save the world from the villain Sin. Who is the Sin? I don't know his evil villain. Cowman, is he one of your enemies? No, I don't know him, but I can probably take him down better than this new guy ever could. Okay, okay, everyone, let's chillax. He might not be here to take our jobs. He could be here to help us, as well as the rest of the world. I did see that, man. You were awesome, but I think next time you could. Whoa, slow down, guys. Let's focus on this new guy so we can share gl our glory stories later. When is this new guy supposed to show up? I've heard as early as Christmas Eve. Wait, that's tomorrow. No way, Christmas can't be tomorrow. Is it really Christmas Eve? Yes, Hulk. I think the musclers are, are cutting off so circulation to your brain. <laughs> this means we have to act fast. Learn what his weaknesses are. Learn his enemies. Ah, what if he has a sidekick? There's so much to do. Then we should start tracking this big guy down. I'm so tired. Can't we just book a room somewhere? Just a little bit farther, love. I'm sorry that every Holiday Inn was full. I didn't know that we were going to be going this deep into the holiday season. When the angel came down to Nazareth, I was so scared. But the angel told me not to be frightened, for that God will, will be with me. I'm still so nervous about this whole thing. What if I'm not going to be a good mother to God's son? Mary, Mary, stop your ring and breathe. God chose you for a reason, and he chose me to be your husband for a reason. Or at least that's what I keep telling myself. <laughs> Try to hide himself, or maybe he's in a disguise. I'm tired of looking. Maybe he has a weakness like tuna or catnip or those little squeak mice or those darn little balls of light you can never catch. Whoa, well, down, kitty. We don't know that stuff yet. Maybe one of these fine citizens had heard something about him. I'll go ask. Excuse me, fine citizens. Have you happened to hear of a new superhero around here? A new superhero? No, Joseph, have you? No way, are you really Superman? And Hulk? Are you really Thor? <laughs> oh, get a grip. No, we haven't. Do you know a place where you could stay? Apparently, all the hotels are full. I know a man down the road who has a nice stable. You could go ask if he knows of a place. Wow, you guys, you guys are my heroes. You save the world like every day, and you're here right now. Yes, we know. We are pretty powerful. Oh my, miss, are you pregnant? Yes, I'm doing a date. It may even be tonight. Oh, there's nothing better than a baby. I hope we run into you again. I would love to hold your baby. Me too. I love to rock babies to sleep. And you're sure you don't crush them? <laughs> yes, yes, that would be nice. I'm sure I would need all the help you could get. Well, my feet are getting sore now. Good luck with the search for a new superhero. You, 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 you would come see us again? Oh. <laughs> Do you know if it's a boy or a girl? What are you going to name it? It's a boy. His name will be Jesus. Oh, well, my feet are getting stirred now. Good luck with the search for a new superhero. Ugh, this job is so lame. Hey, I wouldn't complain. At least it's paying for that data plan and that fancy phone. 
Ha ha ha, you think you're so funny. No, seriously, this job is so lame. Nothing exciting ever happens. Like, all my friends work at Starbucks and get free coffee. And what do I get? I get to watch over my flocks by midnight and shovel sheep poop. It's just so disgusting. Oh, come on, it isn't that bad. It's a clear night on Christmas. Oh, God couldn't have gave us more of a beautiful night. Oh, you're one of those, those God people? Well, yeah, I guess I am. I mean, I don't know. I heard that God is sending his son to save us from our sin. Who is that? I am trained in karate and not afraid to use it. Better question, where are you? Sheesh, left a sparkle. Miley Cyrus called and she wants us a clean bodysuit back. Miley Cyrus ain't got nothing on my son. But I'm here to tell you that Jesus, the Son of God, was born tonight. Rejoice! Emmanuel, the Savior of the universe, was born tonight here in Bethlehem. Oh my goodness, are you serious? How exciting. Where is he? Can I go see him? Yes, please do. Follow the star by night and you'll see the baby wrapped in swaddling clothes. Um, I don't know what swaddling clothes are, but I guess just so I won't see the baby. I don't know I'm in the right place. But God loves us so much that he is willing to send his son so that even when we do sin, we are forgiven. It's called grace. Isn't that great? Wow, God's love is amazing. I know a church, I know a church in Laguna Niguel that knows a thing or two about grace things. There's a crazy pastor that is always talking about it. Oh, don't you worry. We know that church, too, and that crazy pastor. But I still don't get how sending a baby is going to help, though. How is he going to stop me from, like, sin? For God so loved the world that he gave his one and only son, that whoever believes in him shall not perish but have eternal life. But seriously, get, get a move on. The star is right over there. Okay. You heard anything about a new superhero around here? We have been looking for him all day. We're exhausted. Well, first an angel, now a superhero. He drives more better than I thought. I don't know anything about a new superhero, but did you guys know G God's son was born tonight? Wait, did you say God's son? That's our guy. Whoa, 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 whoa. We haven't been searching for a baby. How can a baby save the world? I don't get it either. I just want to see the super baby God thing because it sounds cool. Isn't he wonderful? Yes, he is. All right, you superhero, put your hands up. Nobody's taking my job. Yeah, what he said. Oh yeah, settle down, guys. Can you see there's a baby? Suit? Well, yeah, but he's gonna take our job. But oh, he's so cute. <laughs> yes, he is. I didn't expect to see you guys so soon, but what does it think about my son taking your job? Well, we heard that Jesus is the new superhero coming to town. And that he's going to save the world from sin. So we thought that no one would need us anymore, but it's just a baby, so there's nothing to worry about, guys. You're right. What? <laughs> I, I was getting worried. So is he just a baby, or? Well, right now he is, but then he will grow up and save us all from our own sin. We heard all about that. Angels came down to us and told us not to be afraid that God's son was born tonight. You know, you're starting to sound like one of those church people. Oh, well, I am? Well, maybe could I go to church with you sometime? 
Yeah, sure. I know just the place to take you. Hold on, hold on. So Jesus isn't going to take over my job? I still can go out and save people? Of course you of course you still get to go out and save people. Well, God has sent his son so we can be saved from the s ourselves and the sins we commit. So now when we can save people, we, we can tell them about Jesus' unending love. Wow, I think I could do that. Hmm, stop right there, mister. I'll save you innocent citizens, but Jesus will save you with God's love. I like it. I'm so glad you all came to see Jesus and that now you'll spread God's love. This is very Merry Christmas. No, it's, it's a super, super Christmas. Christmas.